All right. So who can I? Okay, we got. Oh, we got a sniper. Another sniper. Hell yeah. Oh, I picked the right one, too. Too easy. Great job. I knew you had it in you. Pretty good. All right, see, so we've kind of blocked him off. So you know what we're going to do now? We're going to have Barrier grab the flag. I She's a badass. Let's get her some XP. Nope. I'll help you. There we go. So I can get her a little bit of experience and let's grab the flag and call it good. That was awesome. Looks like you've all worked up a good sweat. Hopefully you're getting along a little better. Is he serious? He tortures us and that's supposed to make us buddies? Get used to it. Somewhere along the line, this guy turned into a nightmare drill sergeant. All right. I hear the Ranger Corps training gets brutal. Don't even get me started. I get the shivers just thinking back on it. Trust me, it's gonna get rough. Yeah? That sounds like a story. What kind of crap did they put you guys through? Well, that's encouraging. Okay, that's enough training for now. That storm's not gonna wait on us. Let's start packing it in. Oh, that's enough to up my rank to 11 for a couple other spots. I'm right back. I'm gonna upgrade everything. Ship parts, yes, yes, I can increase. It's just like a tank, but using ship. So let's go and do stuff. Here comes the blizzard! Everyone hurry! Get back to the Centurion! Captain Wallace, come in! Everything's fine, Marie. We're coming back right now. No, this concerns another matter. Remain deployed for now. Huh? There's someone approaching us on the ice. Visibility is too poor to see if they're armed. Someone on foot? In this weather? There are lots of islands around here, mostly fishing villages, but there are some Imperial bases too. You think it could be an Imperial scout? Guy must have pissed someone off to get stationed all the way out in this frozen hellhole. We should hide. If they're an enemy, we'll let him pass, sneak up from behind, and take him alive. Roger. Huh. Look at how they're walking. I don't think they're military. <sighs> it's a civilian! Hey, you there! Stop! Huh. Don't worry. We're not going to hurt you. We're Federation soldiers. Are you from one of the nearby islands? Why are you out here all by yourself? Uh, um, the, the Empire suddenly appeared in our village. They... They said they were making a requisition. There are 20 more coming. My friends and family. We abandoned our homes and ran for it. But we can't make it much farther. I, I saw the ships and came to ask for help. <laughs> Driving out civilians and taking everything they own. It's been working for them so far. Marie, I need you to check in with the captain immediately. Tell him I'd like permission to house about 20 civilians on board. One step ahead of you. He's already given the okay. If we're taking in refugees, though, we'll need to take out the Imperial forces pursuing them. Rescue the civilians and eliminate their pursuers. Time to see if your training's paid off. Good luck. All right, let's intercept them at the village. We have our next mission. First, capture the enemy's hilltop camp to stop them from pursuing the civilians. Once that's done, Squad E will retreat while eliminating any hostile units to give chase. 
The mission will be complete when the Hoffman reaches its designate, designated extraction point. Be warned there are no ordinary grunts, there's some of the Empire's finest troops. Look out for interception fire from snipers while you're on the move. By the way, we picked up early signs of a snowstorm gathering nearby. Blizzards reduce visibility, so seeing through them is going to be difficult. But that goes both ways. Moving through a storm could help you avoid interception fire. Victory, enemy base camp is captured. Failure, the enemy occupies your base camp. All allied infantry fall in action. 20 turns have passed, or the Hoffman is destroyed. Use what you learned from the mock battle. I have total confidence in you, Squad E. By the civilians, time to escape. Squad E, move out! Imperial pursuit will come from the south, going after the civilians. We need to seize that hill and intercept them. Buy those refugees enough time to evacuate the combat zone. I'd offer fire support if we knew where the enemies were. Maybe the Centurion's radar can tell us. Let's give it a shot. Okay, so I guess maybe we should try... How do you do... Command. Orders. Um... I guess that's not how, so... Hold on a minute here. Oh, ship orders, that's what I'm looking for. You know what? Let's try radar. And let's try the base. I want to see what's going on at the base. Come in, Centurion. Requesting recon support. Oh, 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 yes. Riley, get in there and blow them guys up. Keep an eye on the enemy's movement. Keep your eyes open. So this is war. Oh, can't capture it yet. So we're going to have Rosetta move one more time. Take him out and capture the base. No problem. Ooh, I stepped on a mine though. Don't do that, folks. That's what you don't want to do. I know a scenario when I see one. Thank goodness. Done and done. There we go, we got it. That was quick. Okay, we bought some time. Now it's our turn to retreat. Prepare to intercept! Be careful, Claude. New enemies on the field. What the? They're fast! All right, I'll watch out for them. <laughs> oh, it's crazy girl time. All right. All right, looks like Supersonic Marath will be getting my shell. Come on. I see. Oh, I should have brought an uh, um, Alucard. All right, let's move forward, Nico and Rosetta. So Nico, you go first. You got definitely the most hit points. This is quite a storm. Do these happen often on the Crystal Sea? Yeah. Guess we'll be fighting the snow the entire way. All right, into the head. I'll be 
They've taken our base. All right, now we can move around in the middle. We're going to start that by having Kai or Neej. Should we do Neej? No, let's move Raz up. Okay, I don't know what her face is. Ooh. Okay. In the face. Hell yeah. Kind of get it over here so they can't quite get the shot at me. All right, now sniper time, folks. Okay, Nage. Let's get that lancer actually. See if we can get her face. Oh god, they just laugh when you kill them. Good job, babe. Now let's start flowing through. Let's defend Nige. Take him out. One more shot. Too easy. Stay close to your squad mate. To the head. I love it when they work together. There we go. Now the Grenadier can quit firing at my guy. Let's try it one more time. I'm so close. So close. There we go. APC, get the wounded and the refugees to the back. Everyone else, intercept and defend the Centurion. Here they come. Hmm. <laughs> Who are those two? Are they with huh. the Empire? Don't let their looks fool you. Those are elite soldiers. They're nothing but weapons themselves. Our objective is complete. It's time we took our leave. Shut it. I don't take orders from you. <laughs> hey, they're getting away. Are we gonna follow them, Claude? No. We should prioritize protecting the civilians. Keep your eyes open, but stay in formation. The enemy knows the position of the Cygnus fleet. They'll have a hard time following us, but we could be in for a long fight. Oh yeah, there we go. That's kind of nice. Take your time, everyone. Don't lose your footing. <sighs> Glad we got permission to get them on the Centurion. Yeah. Frankly, I'm surprised they would let civilians on a ship that's basically one big military secret. Any normal captain would have shut us down instantly. No amount of pleading would have done it. Hmm? What's up, Brass? Oh, just... one of the villagers caught my eye. Brass, they're refugees! 
There's a time and a place for hitting on chicks, and it sure isn't here or now. It wasn't like that, okay? It was a guy. Look, never mind. You there! Halt! That area is off limits. Oh, sorry. Uh, I, I can't read. This way. Follow the people in front of you. Uh, thanks. <laughs> Hang in there. You'll have a warm place to sleep soon. Oh, uh, thank you. Kai, what's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. Just worried about him, I guess. He looks like he hasn't eaten in days. I see. While this section is yours, I'm going to patrol the restricted areas. Sure. <sighs> Good day. Have you been waiting long? I've never been much for these military formalities myself. <laughs> Why not take a load off, Lieutenant? My name is Dr. Heinrich Belgar, although Belgar will suffice. I am but a humble scientist, in the employ of the Empire. I presume you're not a man to mince words, so allow me to be direct. Klaus Voltz, I would like for you to lead my personal squad, XO. Luck hasn't exactly been on your side, has it, Colonel? Blamed for the loss at Siegfall, Relegated to supply duty. But we both know that's a bit beneath you, isn't it? You're the most talented commander in the Empire. I hate to disappoint you, Doc, but I'm a man of very specific tastes. For my lovers, for my colleagues. For your enemies, too, I hear. Soulmates, you call them. Hmm. <laughs> they are on the Crystal Sea. As you predicted, I note. Your records show a curious fixation on them, but it's unlikely you'll see them again on supply duty. Your account of their naval fleet is critical intel. It could very well change the course of the war. But your superiors are a bit set in their ways. A ship crossing over land is beyond their limited imagination. So instead, they discredited you, reassigned you, washed their hands of you. As it stands, your soulmate may lead the Federation to victory. Join me, however, and you'll be free to fight the fleet on the Crystal Sea and Squad E to your heart's content. Flatter me all you want. I'm not switching squads if it means abandoning my team. Ah, but of course. Your elite tank platoon, Ausbruch. I imagine you've heard of their predicament. Or perhaps they've kept you in the dark. What? That vault's lineage of yours is quite a shield, all things considered. The officers can't lay a finger on you. So they intend to retaliate in what petty ways they can, disbanding your dear Ausbruch and detaining its soldiers. Now, I may not look it, but rest assured my voice holds some sway with the Imperial Mill. I've already laid the groundwork for transferring the members of Ausbruch into XO. Once the transition is complete, Ausbruch can return to being the decorated vanguard unit it always has been. That's an awful lot of work just to get little old me on your side. What do you get out of this? It's simple. All I ask is that you pursue Squad E, 
and eradicate them. I trust you'll accept, yes? Trading myself for the fate of my soldiers, huh? <laughs> Fine, Doc. I'll play your game. But a man can't look this shabby if he's going on a date with his soulmate. We'll need to outfit ourselves. <laughs> Naturally, yes. My accounts are yours to plunder. Arm your squad with the best that money can buy. Now that that's settled, there's someone I'd like to introduce you to. And who might that be? Now, will you all join us, please? <laughs> this is Forsetti. He shall serve as your strategist in the coming endeavor. A man of most exceptional talent, I assure you. <laughs> and of course... <laughs> These are Nicola and Chiara. Worry not. They may look sweet as summer, but I assure you their combat talents are quite beyond imagining. Use them well. These angels are my masterpieces. Ensure their talents are not wasted. <laughs> <laughs> With introductions out of the way. Welcome, Vaults, to the Imperial Science Board's most elite test squad, XO. Lieutenant Klaus Vaults, we open our arms to you in greeting. I do truly hope that you'll all get along. <sighs> My, I could not imagine more perfect timing. I have a very special surprise for all of you. Allow me to introduce our exceptional guest, the Lady Crimeria, my beautiful weapon of mass destruction, a Valkyria. Reborn for our modern age. She's a Valkyria. All right, folks, we're here. Chapter 9. We will wrap it up now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take care.